The much-awaited labor rakai returns today and the tourists here in the island are surely feeling the excitement. But to ensure a good experience for everyone, safety protocols are still in place. For the latest updates, we have Laila Francisco reporting to us live from Boracay. Laila, kamusta sa Boracay? Party, party, Robbie! Ano ba nasagot ka sa'yo? Oh my gosh! Grabe, the atmosphere is very much alive here at the beach capital of the country as the island holiday, Love Boracay 2022, officially started today. After two years since the pandemic started, the country's hottest tourist spot, Boracay, is now all set to welcome travelers as the much-awaited Love Boracay 2022 resumes. Even the workers can't hide their excitement. Ready, ready, naman, ma'am. Na prepare naman po lahat. Expected na namin na gato mangyari na dadami tao kaya. The famous bars in the beach say they are expecting a lot of tourists. Because in four years' time, wala pong Love Boracay. Kung ako titingin eh, yung mga kahit sa lokal lang natin na tourist, no? Iuhaw na uhaw din sila na ma-experience ulit yung laboracay. Kasi dati talagang dinarayo yan dito. And with the event happening this weekend, Boras hotels are already seeing an influx in guest bookings. But the officials assure minimum health standards would still be observed. The property is so big and open, so there is no, no problem with social distancing and all that. No, we, we do follow the protocols. According to authorities, this Labor Day event will be different from the past ones as tourists are expected to be more respectful of the island, which perfectly suits this year's Love Boracay 2022 better than ever theme. The Boracay uh, Interagency Task Force adopted a resolution in 2019 that there is a need for us to replace uh, Love Boracay and uh, the unsustainable tourism practices that come with it. No, that's why we have uh, uh, we have organized this event, yung Love Boracay. Nagsimula tayo noong 2019. We, we are having uh, sustainability talks dito. To ensure that cleanliness will be observed, cleanup drives will also be conducted every morning until Sunday. With this, the Malay Aklan mayor reminds, Kung ano man mga policies dito sa Boracay, eh, dapat sundin lang natin no? to avoid any problems. Yun lang. Kasi bawal kasi sa Boracay ang pasaway. Robbie Gretchen, as you can see behind me, let me just show you. Most hotels here are conducting their own private parties for their guests uh, in the hotels. And if you can also see, no, yung foot traffic, it's uh, not as much compared to last Holy Week. Pero parami na sila ng parami, Robbie, no, and uh, Gretchen. Yesterday, nung nagpunta kami dito sa beachside, it wasn't really um, ganito kadami. But now, nakikita na natin na uh, there is an influx of uh, people or guests dito sa Boracay. The officials are also looking into increasing the allowed tourist capacity in the island from 20 to 25,000 starting next year. And that's the latest here. Gretchen, Robbie, habol kayo. Let's party. Happy weekend. <laughs> Kung pwede lang, maraming salamat, Laila Pangilinan.